has a resistance. This thermistor has a resistance of about 700, 700 ohm at room temperature. So what we're going to do is we are going to light this and warm this one up. And let's see the resistance go down. That's a flame. This is a flame. And I'm going to light this. Can you see it's going down? Yeah, you go to zero and you get spoiled. Huh? <laughs> I just spoiled one the other day. And of course, $12 go up in smoke. <laughs> and if I pour cold water on it, then it will go maybe close to a thousand ohm. So right now, try it. Uh, uh, it's uh, too inconvenient to try that, but you, you can try that. Huh? You can try that. These are the variations that you can do. Now this is not very, this is not very sensitive. I will show you a sensitive one, and this is, this is the black thermistor that we are talking about here. The black thermistor. And this black thermistor costs about $2 if you go and buy in one of the local shops in Singapore. $2, only $2 in Singapore is very cheap in Singapore. Uh, I don't know about UK. Uh, this is a thermistor, and usually when you want to buy, they will ask you what is the serial number that you need because they are in the electronic components. And this is only 10 ohm. This is only 10 ohm. Let's scale it down so that we can read decimal points. This is 10.6 ohm, 10.8, 10.7. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to warm this thermistor with my hand. And you notice it's black in color, isn't it? Not? The covering, why? It's because it can absorb heat better. So I put my fingers over it. And let's see the resistance go down to 10.4, 10 10.3, 10.2, 10.1. Of course, my fingers not that warm, but it is sensitive enough to be able to detect a difference in temperature. And of course, if I were to put near one of your mouth, if you've got a lot of hot air, then then the 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 the, the, uh, the mister will go down to zero, right? Huh? Huh? Anybody wants to try how hot the air that comes out from their mouth? All right, now it is about 9.5. I'm just joking. Uh. It is, it's meant to be a joke. Uh. Relax, uh, relax. It's meant to be a joke. <laughs> yeah, not very funny. Uh. Yeah. But some people, as you know, when, when they talk, uh, they always like to talk about themselves. But I suppose we've got to sell ourselves like, like Singapore is always selling itself. A small red dot in the world making a lot of noise. Uh, all right, this is 9.5 9 ohm. Let's cool it. Let's cool it. And we cool it by removing my fingers. And let's see the resistance going up. Can you see it's going up? It's going up. And going up. And going up. And this is very, very sensitive. In fact, a thermistor can be designed in such a way as to become a thermometer. Can it be? It can be a thermometer because the resistance changes with temperature. Right? So anything that changes with temperature, that physical property can always be, be uh, rigged up as a thermometer. Now, all these are known as transducer. What is a transducer? That's a good question.